Hi, I'm Mark. In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace your lawnmower's flywheel key. And now I can install the new key. I'll place it into the groove, and then give it a light tap with a hammer to make sure it's seated. To install the flywheel, I need to make sure that the groove in the flywheel is aligned with the flywheel key. This indexes the magnets to the ignition coil for ignition. I'll install the nut and secure it. Now reinstall the ignition coil. I'll align it with the posts on the engine and install the bolts. I'll leave the bolts just finger tight for now. And I'll reinstall the kill wire. I'll rotate the flywheel so the magnets are in line with the coil. Now I can set the gap. The gap will be specified in the engine's repair manual. Usually it's going to be somewhere around 14 thousandths of an inch. I'll use a flywheel gapping tool to do this. If you don't have one of these tools, which you probably don't, you can just use a thick business card. I place the card between the coil and the flywheel. Again, I'll make sure the magnets are in line with the coil. Now I'll push the coil firmly against the flywheel and tighten up the bolts. The card will set the proper gap. And now I can remove the card. Now I can untie the rope and release the bale and brake. Now I can reinstall the spark plug wire and the blower cover. And I'll secure the cover with the screws. Now I'll reinstall the starter. And I'll finish by reinstalling the cover. 